How are you feeling? You're tired? Yeah, you don't have to talk if you don't want to. It's okay. How are you feeling, Dad? Uh, nauseous, uh, anxious, and nervous. Big three. And I'm feeling the same, except the fact I want to cry on top of it. I just want to scream on top of it. They have a nice bed in the back for us. Bill made it for her. Name and date of birth. Arabella, um, May 17th, 2008. June. I mean, February. I have three kids. I'm sorry. Just need an arm from a parent here. Do you want one of these too? Should we get you one? Okay. I've got a couple for you. Let's put it right here on your foot. What do you think? You want it right here? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Look. She wants it on her arm. <laughs> well, look, okay, let's put it on this arm then. Look it right there. There's one. Now, this one says you're not allergic to anything. Correct? Not, not that way. No. Okay. Okay. <laughs> You yeah. get two. You want two? You get two, baby. Nope, you have to you have that one. Should we get dad one? Okay, we'll do it here in a little bit. There we go. All right, we have it done today. Um, getting her tonsils and lipnoids removed. Adenoids. And is that is it like like a bad surgery? Like it's not too bad. I'm gonna have you sign one more here. Um, one of the things about anesthesia is they come out of it really kind of confused, and so they might be crying more out of like what the hell's going on? Yeah, okay. that type of thing. There's a lot of confusion from what's going on in that. So this one just says she hasn't had anything to eat since after midnight. It also says she hasn't had any alcohol in the last 24 hours. But Oh, no. I think we're good on that for another thousands of years. <laughs> Keep it. Okay, so. 
for this, they just used a little mask. And this one smells like bubble gum. <laughs> I'm chewing bubble gum. <laughs> yeah. You want to smell this? It smells oh. like bubble gum. Does it smell good? Yeah. Just use a little mask, put it in sleep, and then it will start an IV. Yes, they told us. Yeah. Yeah. They told us about that part. Yeah. And that's just for hydrations in case of emergency? Uh, it, they actually give anesthesia through it too. Oh. Um, so they can put her to sleep with the mask, but you wouldn't want to use that much gas to keep them under that long. Um, so they use the IV for anesthesia. Okay. Okay. But yeah, she gets my fluids through it. Uh, she gets the IV kind of and all that sort of thing. You smoked good. You farted. You poo pooed. Did you really? Are you lying? You didn't poo poo. Or did you fart? You pooed. Did you poop in your underwear? No. Did you fart in your underwear? Not that we're aware of. Who has her matching band? Okay. And what's your birthday? So he'll be your next visitor. Okay. And can you tell me what we're doing today? Getting her tonsils and lipnoids. Adenoids removed. Perfect. Okay. Um, so, hey, hi. How are you guys? This is good. Now how are you? Anesthesia. Dr. Burry will be in and then we'll get the room ready and I'll be back, okay? Hey, Bella, how are you? Say hi. Hey. I'm with anesthesia. Uh, how's family do with anesthesia? Do you okay? Um, I'm the only one that's had real anesthesia. He got goofy gas. I got put out with gas for my wisdom teeth. Okay. Yeah, yeah, but I had anesthesia and I did completely fine with it. Okay. We get her back there, we use that mask, a few breaths of anesthesia out, we get an IV started. We get some, uh, a couple different anti-nausea medicines. So one, one of them has some anti-inflammatory properties, which is nice. And then some IV Tylenol. That's it. They get a little mask airway. We don't put a breathing tube in it. They wake up rowdy and recover them. 
Okay. Yeah, in and out. Yeah, she's had surgery here before, but she had her ear tubes put in. Her ear tubes, yeah. Yeah. Good. What do you think, Arabella? Good idea? She's like, no. She's tired. All right. She's this is just consent for anesthesia. I don't know. Yeah. Late night. Did you go trick or treating? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Papa. Are you a princess? Yes, actually. Oh, <laughs> All right. We'll see you guys in a bit. Thank see you. She took your pressure cuff. suck on they're not to bite it but what it will do is help to numb the back of their throat okay, okay. so they can swallow it it's the medicine and helps just numb the throat are you playing silly are you playing silly <laughs> what you're playing silly You're scared? Why? Mama. Are you scared because I'm scared? Okay, I'm not scared no more. I'm brave. Yeah. Are you going to be brave? I'm going to be brave too. Mama. If sissy be brave, mommy be brave, okay? We're going into the bar there. She's out of surgery now, and I'm very pissed off because I literally told them right away to bring me to her, and I had to sit there and listen to her crying and screaming. Super dry. Is that her friend? Yeah. She's okay. There's the beautiful girl. You're doing so good. I'm so proud of you. I am so proud of you. I won't let you go, I promise, okay? You're in my arms, and I'm not gonna let you go, okay? But yeah, so we're just gonna let her rest. But she's doing good now that she's with mommy.
missile stick is going to be your follow up appointment with Dr. Murray. It's about in two weeks um, at the office. You guys saw him at before. I can hear she's here. Like, I can't hear her. trying to see. She's swallowing her spit and stuff, but she's not wanting anything. This will help you. It'll make you feel better. No. Yeah, she still has like 15 minutes so far. You guys, it's time to get close, so no worries, no rush on it. We just have to have her sip a little something before she leaves. Make sure that that throat's not too numb. She is able to swallow her own spit. Okay. So, like, where exactly like, are, is everything at? Like, I don't know where the tonsils are. Oh, okay. so, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so, and so, where where are the stitches then? So they're on the inside. Okay. Yes. Okay. And then where's the lip? Abnormal. Abnormal. They're on the top part, like above the tonsils. So there's like no surgical things inside her nose. No. No. Why is she bleeding out her nose? Oh, she has a bleeding nose. It might have just been because she had a little bit of spit that had a little bit of blood in it, and it, when she was wrestling around, it got up in there. But as long as it's not actively bleeding out of her nose, it's still okay. Because okay, I was like wondering, I didn't know where any of that stuff mm -hmm. came out. Hi, sweetie. Oh, oh you're so sleepy. Can we have you drink some juice? Can we do a sip? Can you make sure, can you swallow? What did you dress up for for Halloween? Princess. You were a pretty princess. What color was your dress? Uh, was it pink? Of course. <laughs> did you get lots of candy? Yeah. Did you treat? Trick or treat? Happy Halloween! Maybe we also fell on the stairs. Oh no! That's inevitable. Yeah. Yeah, but she didn't tell us until we were home. She fell at the very first house. Oh. She didn't tell us until we were home and they were blowing her away, but. What the hell? Poor thing. She's a tough girl. She broke her arm and only cried for about a minute. How'd you break your arm? Uh, she fell off the couch. It was a buckle fracture. Oh. Yes. It was just a year ago. Oh my goodness. Did you get a pretty pink cast? Pink and purple. <gasps> Did you get pink and purple? No. But yet mommy still has them. <laughs> Can you lick this? It tastes good. See? My mom ate it. Mmm. Mmm. It tastes so good. Where are we going? They <laughs> <laughs> like, turn away from you. See, wherever I want, where I don't want to see that lady in the blue scrubs. <laughs> no, I should probably turn away from her so she doesn't keep offering it to her. Yeah, I keep offering it. I'm gonna drink all this juice over here because it looks so yummy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drink it all. I'm gonna. It's all gonna be gone. Then what? Do you want it first before I drink it all? No. No. Just a little sip. Can you do a teeny tiny sip so we can go home? Just teeny tiny. Oops, sorry. And they blood all over me. Oh. Okay. Just a little sip. These are the worst. We always drip. Just a little sip. My hair is tickling my nose. Try to say you just really. No. Try to just a little sip. You can go home and snuggle with Mama. She's not normally really like this either. Really? So I'm kind of enjoying it. Yeah, you're going to take the best nap today. 
with all the cuddles. I have a little boy that's four, and he is a cuddle monster. And it's nice because I, I have two other kids. My seven-year-old doesn't like to be anywhere near me. <laughs> and then my son, who's five months old, couldn't care less about cuddles. As long as he's just in my arms facing the TV, he yeah. don't care. Oh like, my god. He doesn't like no more snuggles. Mm. But her, she loves my snuggles. Mainly, um, we say Bella, or her main name is Sissy. Oh, Bella. Bella, Bella calls you Sissy, huh? Mm. One sip of juice and you can go bye bye. Okay, just take one sip of juice and you can go bye bye. You want to take one sip so we can go see Gus Gus? <gasps> Gus Gus? Yeah, one sip. Take one sip and we can go see Gus Gus, okay? Hey, look at me. Bella, I'm not going to force you to drink it, so you don't need to turn your head like I'm going to force you. Okay? Can you just hold it for me? Can we start with that? Can we start with you just holding it? Can you just hold it? I'll let you guys work on that. I'm going right up here if you need anything. so I can take it off. Can you need some water? You want some water? No. You want a popsicle? You want ice cream? Don't wrap it around your finger. Okay, don't wrap it around your finger. Don't put it around. Okay. 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 You want some pudding? You want some pasta? Mm
too heavy. So Bella is at a surgery and she's doing good. She had tonsil surgery so um, when she got home she ate some chocolate pudding and now is drinking one of those animals. Huh baby? Yeah. Um, she's doing good. and. Yeah. Let's see what happens next.